So uh, you walk in, uh, it's a I need to crop this. full term, 41 weeks uh, gestation, and baby's frowning when you arrive. Okay. Uh, you're 40 minutes from the nearest hospital, seeing a safe, Great. and you know, volunteer firefighters as well. I have extra hands. So thank you, fire department. So we know the gestational age. What was that gestational age? Again? 41 weeks. 41 weeks. Uh, so we're turn infant, uh, which is good. Uh, baby uh, comes in, and we're going to immediately, baby come in, we're going to immediately put baby up on top of mom's chest, uh, and then my partner and I, you want to grab the hat, we're going to try to <coughs> slither this child in. Uh, so uh, right away as baby comes out, uh, quite vigorous, a uh, little cyanotic in the limbs, but full, solid cry, nice and loud. Lovely. So we're just going to slide baby right into our bag. Zach, come on over on this end. The head end would be great. Sure. And we'll just tuck this right up over baby's head. And we'll tuck that hat on that on that child. And we can see the baby's crying right now. Do I have any secretions in the mouth or the yeah, nose? Just, um, it seems like normal amount of secretions. Okay, so. Uh, so we can just take it. Now, if, if there wasn't substantial secretions, we wouldn't need to suction. So we could just do a cloth can be useful as well. If there's uh, over the over the nose, we can wipe across the face and uh, move anything off the face. If we had anything in the mouth and nose, we'd like to go mouth then nose. So we uh, just go down in the back. We're gonna release, squirt any secretions, and then go to each nair and squirt out and squirt out. And baby's got attention. Baby's healthy and doing well. I, I think that I'd still like. I think in this situation that we'll still put our SPO2 on. So we're going to be following our SPO2, and we're going to be targeting, uh, as per the NRP, our SPO2. So originally, we should have SATs above 55. So we'll bring our monitor over. So in this case, we'll pull our monitor over. So we'll go to the right hand, uh, and we'll also, I think, we'll also get our heart, put our uh, uh, RCG leads on. So we'll, we'll wipe, and we'll get our, get our electrodes on. You can tear holes or just tuck them in, uh, and then we'll have our heart rate on the monitor. So now we see the baby... Uh, still crying, how's tone? So you see your heart rate on the monitor, 180. 180, okay. Uh, tone is good, very vigorous, uh, crying with minimal stimulation, and uh, no respiratory distress. So we've been more than a minute. Uh, we've definitely allowed for cord, uh, delayed cord clamping. So now we can clamp and cut the cord. Uh, so, so now cord is clamped. Uh, how is my airway breathing tone doing presently? So uh, airway is clear, you don't know, note any secretions or any sounds. <clears throat> okay, uh, so we're gonna we're gonna leave uh, baby there. So I'm just going back to my reference. Uh, so we have good tone. Baby can stay. Uh, we did suction, uh, which is going well. Uh, through kind of goals of resuscitation. So we could check a uh, blood sugar uh, in the heel. It'd be uh, lovely uh, to see what is our blood sugar. Uh, we'll get our temperature, get an auxilla temperature, and make sure that we have a temperature. We want to get mom, uh, so the bag on top, I think at this point if baby's crying, uh, we put uh, either uh, face up or face down uh, uh, in between mom's breasts. We can lay baby there. Uh, I think we could cover baby up inside the bag, leave uh, baby's face out. We're crying and we're monitoring breathing, heavy SVU2 and heart rate. So we'll keep baby warm. We want to make sure auxilla temperature is above 36.5. We do have an airway obtained. We do have breathing. This is another good run memory of what is what is a bit four minutes and thirty seconds. So we'll say that's we're five minutes. So five minutes at eighty-five. Oh, that's good. Uh, so that's what we expect that to be based on our uh, predicted uh, targeted oxygenation set. Uh, Six point two. Six point two, which is great. Uh, we could take a blood pressure. Uh, not this child is doing quite well. Uh, if we're taking a blood pressure, a uh, small cuff over the. Uh, over the femur will work best for you. Uh, so we can take and just say, we'll say, what is the blood pressure that comes through? We're getting really kind of very cautious here with this child. <coughs> the blood pressure over 35, math is 45. Yeah, and, and right. emotional support for, uh, for the family. I feel like emotional support for me at this point. <laughs> That's like, uh, through the other side. So that is the, the kind of goal. We're gonna now monitor, kind of on-go monitor the child, watching that we maintain good tone, uh, that we're breathing well, uh, and uh, then uh, transport off to hospital, being very thankful that we didn't have to really do much of anything other than keep the baby warm.